Assalamualaikum and good evening. My name is Nur Hadiana binti Nasruddin from Polytechnic Sultan Salahuddin Abdul Aziz Shah. And we present a paper named Design and Development of Fifth Order Shari Chef Low Pass Filter by Using Lump Elements. As an introduction, microwave filter is a linear two-part network controls the frequency response at a certain point in a microwave system. Other than that, perfect transmission of signal for frequencies in a certain passband region. In communication system, the RF uh, filter is a very important device which is used to discriminate between the wanted and also the unwanted signals. So in this project, the design of fifth order Shavisha flow pass filter by using lump elements and insertion loss method is introduced. Basically, the physical realization of the filter, uh, it has a three types, which is lump elements, the resonator and also the distributed lines. As for the objective, to design and uh, analyze uh, and also to assemble the lump element filter we have first to explore uh, the concept of shavisha filter by doing the deep study about designing the filter uh, using various types of methods and to design the shavisha filter by calculation and also to compare the calculation by using maple 15 to analyze and simulate the design filter in ADS and observe the filter response and to build the fifth order Shabisha filter prototype using lump elements or discrete LC components. And last one, to test the filter with number analyzer and observe the response. Now, uh, let me explain the objective of the paper. Uh, to design the filter, we need to use the method which is called the insertion loss method, uh, which are also called as a shabby chef that have the sharper cut off. Okay, actually the insertion loss method is also the modern procedure and use network synthesis technique to design filter with a completely specified frequency response and the response actually defining the location of poles of the insertion loss method. There are two types of Shavi Chef low pass filter, which in this uh, research we are using the type one, which is a uh, Shavi Chef low pass filter has pole, all pole transfer function. And as you can see in the figure, the equal has equal ripple in the pass band and the uh, ripple monotonically decreasing at the stop band area. Now, uh, let me show you how the filter is designed uh, for the fifth order low pass uh, filter. Okay, from the given uh, filter specification, which is the written loss of uh, 20 dB at 200 kilohertz and the insertion loss of 45 dB at 600 kilohertz. Then we go to the low pass prototype design. Uh, scaling and also the conversion and last one is the implementation. The synthesis of the filter, firstly you need to calculate the value of n. n is uh, actually the order of the filter. So by using this equation, the calculation yields to 4.96 which is the number of n is equal to 5. Then the refer factor is calculated by using the equation the Ripple factor is yield to 0 0.1 and the LAR is yield to 0 0.0432 dB. There are two types of connection for this filter, which is the series inductor and also the shunt capacitor. Where the inductor is connected in series and the capacitor is connected in shunt or parallel. Uh, the next one is uh, we have to calculate the efficiency which yield the number of 0 0.6362. Next, uh, the odd fifth order of the filter then used to calculate uh, by using the ana analytical formula uh, and yields the value of G1 to G5. Basically, the G1 to G5 represent the 
components in this uh, fifth order filter, which is the L1, C2, L3, C4, and the L5. The filter transformation then is uh, use the impedance and also the frequency scaling. It's applied to uh, the 50 ohm uh, system, where uh, when you apply the uh, impedance and also the frequency scaling, you got the real value of the components, which uh, yields at all this value from L1 to L5. Okay, this is uh, elaborate the scaling and also the conversion of a low pass prototype to the real value that uh, meets uh, the realistic frequency and also the impedance requirements. Uh, for the inductance, you have to use this equation that multiplied by Z naughts and it will lead to the new value of L and this one uh, will lead to the new value of C, which is the capacitor. Then, uh, on top of that, the MAPLE15 is used in this filter design because to reconfirm the analytical formula used in the, in the earlier stage, where uh, the MAPLE15 uh, will uh, yield the correct value of the components. Once uh, the confirmation is done by using the ADS, the Chebyshev low pass filter is designed and the response of ideal filter is tabulated. The parameter that needs to be clarified in the ADS is the start frequency and also the stop frequency. By using the lump elements and uh, the, lump el the lump components, which is the real components of inductor and also the capacitor, we use the network analyzer uh, to see the response of the fifth order Chebyshev low pass filter and the frequency range uh, set at the start frequency 1 kilohertz and also the stop frequency at 1 megahertz. Uh, then we take the marker uh, for parameter to be plot, which is S11, S12, S21 and also S22. OK, this is the results uh, from the ADS, which is the schematic from the ADS. Uh, the ADS that uh, we used to design the fifth order of LUM Chevyshev uh, low pass filter and the uh, desired simulation performed the return loss of 20 dB and the minimum incision loss of uh, 45 dB. So this one is the connection as to P file, which is uh, this one is uh, the alternative method that we can use to uh, read from the network analyzer. Okay, this is basically the output from the network analyzer uh, by using the lump elements. So the measurement of the written loss as on one is negative 15,942 dB at the frequency 200 kilohertz and the essential loss of stop band at uh, 600 kilohertz showing the reading of S21, which is negative 45.84 dB. So in this case, the measurement of S1, S21 meets the specification given and also enough to suppress the unwanted signal of the filter. OK, this is a comparison of the ADS and also the network analyzer, which means the simulation and also the real one. So for the conclusion and recommendation, the challenging of this project is to understand the mathematical method and the parameters since there are a few modern methods can be used to design the fifth order Chebyshev low pass filter. Uh, this simulation actually shows good response but it meets the specification of S11 and S21 of the filter. So this project is expected to apply in application that use lower frequency and widely used for radio frequency as well as the microwave communication transmitter and also receiver. That's all for today. Thank you.